a dichotomy is a division into two mutually exclusive and contrasting categories. The key word here is two because the root word for dichotomy is the Greek word dika which means two. So whenever you classify something such that there are only two possible categories to which the thing can belong, either this or that, either A or not A, either 0 or 1. Such classifications are known as binary or dichotomous classifications or dichotomies. The other root word here is tomos which means cutting. So the word dichotomy denotes a cutting up into two parts. Now I said binary classification while defining the word dichotomy. Just like the Greek word dika means two, the root word for binary is the Latin word bini which means comprised of two parts. Here's an example of a dichotomy. An integer can either be even or odd because it is either divisible by two or not. So this is an either or classification, a dichotomous classification. In contrast, tell me, is the classification of real numbers based on their position with respect to zero on the number line dichotomous? The answer is no, because in this case, three possibilities exist. A number can lie to the left of zero or it can be on the right of zero or it can be zero itself. Now tell me, if a division into two parts is called a dichotomy, what should a division into three parts be called? A trichotomy. So we say that the sign-based classification of real numbers is trichotomous. The classification of geometric angles is also trichotomous. They can only be one of these three possibilities, right, acute or obtuse. A classification where even more than three categories are possible is known as a polytomy. Let's see some more examples of dichotomous classifications. The dichotomy of organisms into vertebrates and invertebrates is based on the classifying question, does it have a backbone? There are only two possible answers to that question, either yes or no. Next, there are people who believe that a statement can be either true or false. You are either telling the truth or lying. Such people believe in the dichotomy of truth and falsehood. They believe that truth can have only binary values, 1 or 0. They do not think that something can be partially true or that truth can have shades of grey. Likewise, good and evil is a very common dichotomy in religion, philosophy, literature and movies. We see good and evil as mutually exclusive and opposite categories and think that a person can be either good or evil. This is why we are always surprised when the supposed hero of a movie does a bad thing or when a supposed villain does a good deed. We are surprised because these deeds defy our dichotomous expectations and reveal that this character is not black or white but grey. We often dichotomize gender into masculine and feminine. The moral practical dichotomy is the belief that the moral and the practical are opposites and mutually exclusive. We dichotomize genius into two kinds, natural and learned. And of the two, it is natural brilliance that most of us love, respect and secretly hope for. 